On July 30, 2025, a colossal magnitude 8.8 .8 earthquake struck beneath the Pacific, near Russia's Kamchatka Peninsula. This was one of the strongest quakes recorded in modern times. The result, a devastating trans-Pacific tsunami that rippled across continents, that no one on Earth was prepared for. Or should we have been prepared after this tsunami had already been predicted in a Japanese manga? Welcome to Lab 360, it's time to explore. The massive quake, the sixth strongest ever in recorded human history. Ruptured a 400 by 200 kilometers fault area, striking at a relatively shallow depth of 20 kilometers beneath the sea floor. This abrupt displacement lifted and dropped the seabed, violently disturbing the overlying ocean water. Such vertical motion of the sea floor is the classic mechanism that generates tsunami waves, transforming seismic energy into powerful surging waves, many meters high. The quake also triggered an eruption of Russia's most active volcano, Klyachevskoy, adding to the region's chaos. From the epicenter, tsunami waves radiated outwards across the Pacific. Coastal towns in Kamchatka were hit hardest, waves up to 5 meters inundated districts like Severokurilsk and Paramusher. In Chile and French Polynesia's Marquesas Islands, waves of 2 to 2.5 meters were recorded, prompting precautionary evacuations despite lower than feared impact. Japan ordered evacuations of more than 2 million people, particularly around Fukushima, in fear of another nuclear crisis. Hawaii experienced waves just under 6 feet, leading to evacuation of low-lying coastal zones and disruption of air traffic on islands like Maui. In Northern California especially Crescent City, known to be tsunami vulnerable, waves reached up to 4 feet, flooding docks and causing damage to harbor infrastructure valued at close to $1 million. Crescent City's engineered sacrificial H-dock partially absorbed the surge, but did not completely prevent dock damage and flooding inside the port. In Kamchatka, buildings were submerged, roads flooded, and some local structures destroyed. Evacuations were executed, and hundreds were injured in panic and infrastructure collapse, but miraculously, no confirmed fatalities were reported. In one dramatic moment, Doctors in an operating theater continued life-saving surgery even as the quake shook the building, an inspiring scene widely shared online. In the US, though damage did occur, it was far less severe than feared. Officials credited effective warnings and community preparedness for preventing tragedy. Rapid warnings from the Pacific Tsunami Warning Center enabled evacuations across nations from Japan to Peru, Chile, Ecuador, and the U.S. West Coast. More than 3 million people were safely evacuated before major waves struck, a testament to global preparedness systems upgraded after disasters like the 2004 Indian Ocean Tsunami, which killed around 230,000 people. But, the extremely eerie part is that this tsunami was predicted long ago in a Japanese comic. In her 1999 manga, The Future I Saw, Japanese artist Ryo Tatsuki described a vivid dream in which a massive crack forms beneath the ocean between Japan and the Philippines, triggering a tsunami said to be three times more powerful than the one in 2011. Fans of Tatsuki believe that many of her dream-based predictions, illustrated in her manga, have eerily come true over the years. The manga references real-world events such as the deaths of Princess Diana and Freddie Mercury, the COVID-19 pandemic, the devastating 2011 Japan earthquake and tsunami, and now, the July 30 tsunami as well. What other predictions from that manga are yet to come true, we will only have to wait and watch. But this event on July 30th shows, how a single undersea earthquake can trigger a tsunami, 
felt around the globe from Japan and Hawaii to South America and beyond. Ultimately, this episode underscores the power of nature, and the importance of early warning systems, and above all community resilience. In conclusion, should we be worried about the other predictions that Ryo Tatsuki made in her manga The Future I Saw? Share your thoughts in the comments section below. And be sure to subscribe to the channel for the latest revelations in space exploration. Hit the bell icon to stay updated, and let's continue to explore together.